Alrighty, looks like I am live right now. Let's see here. Make sure this is on and powered up. Okay, we are live on uh, HSFL Paranormal. How's it going, guys? Good to see you. Just wait on some people to come on in. Hopefully, you guys set your bell notifications on. Uh, I am on my way. I'm in an Uber right now on the way to the De La Tosa Mission in San Luis Obispo, California. So, hope to see you guys here very soon. How's everybody doing? Thanks for joining on. Driving on the road right now to the mission. Welcome everybody. people to come into the stream hello guys what's up going to the mission right now it's getting dropped off here this is downtown san luis obispo you guys have seen us do a lot of night stuff welcome to the stream all right all right, so this is my final destination. I just want to thank Tammy for giving me a ride to the mission. So thank you so much. Have a great day. And have a good weekend. All right, guys. Guess we'll walk in the back way here. Is the live stream up, guys? Hey, three people watching. Thank you so much. How's everybody doing today? Just waiting for a few more people to join on, join in the chat. Good to see everybody. So here's some of the old buildings here. Amazing, beautiful day. So this is the beginnings of the mission. This is just a wall that separates. Hey, the sharpshooter, how's it going? We have Rock G. What's going on, guys? So I'm just currently walking around here. Hopefully the stream is working good. Five people watching, thank you. anybody without their permission here all right we are live what's going on 
thought there would be a lot more people coming into the stream on the tour here. Are my notifications not going out or something? Six people watching, hello? Yes, I am live here at the San Luis Obispo de La Tosa, or sorry, de Tolosa mission. Uh, looks like they have some of the carnival stuff out for Christmas with the uh, merry-go-round. See if I can zoom in for you guys. So there you go. Thanks for the five, six people watching. I do appreciate it, guys. I know I was live a little bit ago. Okay, now the notification goes out. Hopefully some more people join on here. Hey, Nero Trigger, what's up, man? Seventeen seventy two is when this mission was founded. There's the mission bells. This is the inside. Hey, Tubby Smith, what's up? There's the Jesus. See the beautiful architecture here. How many people does it say is showing up on your guys' side? Is it saying four people are viewing this right now? So we are inside of the mission. It says only two people are in the chat. It's kind of strange. So there's like another like walkway up to the bell tower here. Straight. Come on, I got more people in my live test than I did with this. This is ridiculous. I thought there would be more people interested in wanting to see this. Hey, four people watching. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm not sure quite what's going on here. It's a beautiful day here. Thank you for the five people watching. I appreciate it.
So this place is rumored at least to be haunted. Uh, yeah, I don't know why the word didn't get out. I tried to text everybody like 30 minutes ago. I thought at least the notifications would go out, but I'm sure everybody's busy. It is it is Saturday. People do have things to do. That is cool. I mean, should I end the live stream and try to go live again? Because I got the notification. Awesome. Cool. Thank you. So here's the little garden. Oh, okay. Huh. That's so strange. I'm almost tempted to like close this out and try it again. Hey, Native Grammy, how's it going? Synth, uh, hold on. Carolyn Hawthorne, what's going on? What's up, y'all? Check in some of these cool plants out. Beautiful garden here. So here's like a little. All right. You guys want me to try to restart this? Well, now seven p There's like a little youth center. Yes, it's a very beautiful place. Okay, guys, I think I'm going to try to do this again. Look, keeps seeming like people are going to join on. And then it dives out. So. Hey, Native Grammy. Good to see you. All right. See, now eight people are watching. Thank you, guys. Nine. Okay, maybe people are finally seeing this. Well, I'm kind of just seeing if maybe this gains a little bit of traction. Because now nine people are in here and it was that one before. So maybe more people are seeing the... Yep, see 10. So I think, I think people are finally discovering that I'm live right now. Guys, make sure you tweet this out, share it out on Facebook, get the word out that I'm live. I really want to show people this because it's absolutely beautiful. I'm sure there's a lot of other people live streaming and I did live stream earlier, so that kind of makes sense, but I was hoping to get a little bit more than this.
<sighs> 11 people thank you so much for joining i really appreciate it you guys thank you for all of your time i do appreciate it i'll be live for maybe hour hour and a half kind of just talking to you guys about this place this mission was built in 1772 they're gonna come it just takes a few i agree i think we just i gotta just be patient here how's it going michelle koyak good to see you welcome to the stream So there's like another like hall for the parish. I don't know if you guys can see this inside. It's kind of hard to see. But here's some of the actual old mission bells. Look how cool that is. Hey, 13 people watching now. Sweet. Let's get that up, up, up. Look at look at how old these copper bells are. Can you guys see those pretty clearly? There's like an old, uh, I guess that was an old plow, I'm guessing. That's super cool. Yes, I know, Michelle. My prayers and heart and soul go out to you, my friend. Hey, how's it going, Wonder Pup? Good to see you. Yes, very nice bells. I know, Michelle. Thank you so much for coming by with your chronic condition that you suffer with. Look at this. Hey, Parnation ex Paranormal Exploration, what's going on? Our Paranation Exploration, how's it going? Good to see you. How cool is that? You can see just how old this thing is by the years of being eaten away. Yeah, please share this stream out, guys. Teak like that when my grandpa was back in the old days. Wow, that's cool. Oh, guys, we found the mission well. How cool is that? So this actually has a grate on it, unlike the other mission. But I'm sure it goes very... Actually, no, they've actually buried this one. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, that, that one is an old plow over there. Hey, Texas Life Julie, what's up? Uh, just doing a live stream here at the San Luis Obispo de Tolosa Mission. Is it buffering bad? Here. Let me check. it doesn't keep buffering so bad um, hmm okay I'll just keep going on with the stream I guess guys I'm buffering in and out okay so at a certain point I'm losing I'm dropping frames I'm not quite sure. I'm trying to set. Okay, let's see here. 
I'll drop it down a little bit further so hopefully this doesn't drop anymore. Hey Yolanda, how's it going? Okay guys, is that better? Hopefully. So I'll go back in here. God, be thy bringer of peace, love, and happiness. I pray that you protect the people who I care about. Show them the love, guidance, peace, and happiness that we all deserve. Show us the way and take control of our life so thy will be done, not ours. Guide us when we are lost. Amen. So glad you like it. I'm doing really good, Yolanda. These old, all these old paintings. It's absolutely breathtaking. Yeah, here goes a little lag here. Thank you so much guys for joining me on here. I do appreciate it. There's the holy water. This was donated in 1948, this plaque. try to do a little prayer here so hope you guys can see this here and I'll try to focus it so you can see me right next to this amazing statues of Jesus hey Eileen K how's it going so I'm going to do a little prayer for everybody here. Who needs a prayer? Let me know in the comment section, guys. 
Sorry, it's going to be hard to see me for a second here. 17 people watching. Thank you so much. Guys, if you need a prayer, let me know. And I can light a candle for you, too. Hey, Paranormal Mama, what's going on? God, I pray for Michelle Koyak that you ease her chronic pain. Help her and guide her and put a shield and light and love and protection around Michelle. I pray that you help her and guide her every day. Amen. Uh, what do you need to, uh, what do you want me to pray for you for, you know, I'm Lean K? Let me know in the comments. God, I ask that you pray, that I pray for Eileen K as she is going through something. I ask that you show her the love and God and light and power and surround her with love and happiness. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Depression. Oh, awesome. Thank you guys so much. I really appreciate it. Oh, I'm so glad you guys like it. 16 people in the house. Thank you guys so much for coming by. So I'll light a candle for you. Chronic pain as well. Okay. God. Here. God. I pray for Eileen Kay for her chronic pain, that you ease her suffering and help her and show her to the light of peace, happiness, and love and being pain-free. I ask that you help guide her and help her and Jesus take the wheel behind her life as he does with ours. Amen. Okay. Here we go with the candles, guys. Here is, I'm trying to find a candle that has not been lit. Most of these have. Yeah, there's not many candles that haven't been lit. To find one, so this is going to be. Whoops, for Eileen and Michelle Koyak. As soon as I could find that wick. Okay, that one's lit for you guys. And this is for all the others who are in need. Hey, Kenneth, the Kentucky fam, what's going on? So I'm giving you guys a live tour here. I lit a candle for all those in this room who are visiting this with me. And I lit a candle for you guys in prayer and protection. Lord, our Father, Lord in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not in temptation, but deliver us from evil. Thy is the kingdom, the power and glory, forever and ever. Amen. It's good to see everybody here. Thank you so much, guys, for visiting. I hope you guys are enjoying this live stream. It's a little more tamed down from my previous live stream, so hope you guys are enjoying it. I just love all the tiles here.
so I was going to see if I could find something here to lay this upon so you guys can see me. It's not the best view in the world. I'm trying to situate it so you guys can see. Okay, I'm going to dip my, my cross in holy water. So I have a little more protection on these paranormal investigations. And prayers for Rock Chi and her depression. And she gets through what she needs to get through in order to be happy. is re-dipped in holy water. It's nice to be in a church on a weekend. Talk about God and love and peace and happiness. As you can see, they are getting ready for Christmas here. You can see this amazing altar these amazing Jesus statues and a cross. The previous mission that we went to, this one was built in 1772. I, got, I hope you guys are enjoying this. I mean, just look at the beauty today. A few clouds in the sky, perfect weather. Palm trees, a beautiful arch walkway. Thank you guys so much for staying. So there's like the mountains that I live by. I don't know if y'all can see that. That's Madonna Mountain right there. It's a popular hiking and biking trail here in San Luis Obispo. Follow me and I'll uh, kind of walk you guys through the area. Give you a little tour. So there's the old mission school ahead of us. And then I will be tomorrow and film the actual video portion of it for present. So I'll give you guys like a little walk around here. It is so beautiful here and serene for sure. Um, so that building you see right ahead of us is the All Louis store. All Louis was a Chinese immigrant from uh, who came to San Luis via the construction of the railroads here in town. And he was very poor, but he finally saved up his money from working on the railroads. And he opened up a store. And we actually have a room in our hotel where I work at named after him. So here's the outside of the mission. Some more of the building that you guys didn't see. Sorry I can't participate in the chat all that much, guys. It's hard to do on Streamlabs. But I'm trying to give you guys the best view of this place as possible. Here's like an old little store.
store. Okay guys, so here's some more of the building. I'll walk up here, check this out. There's a beautiful fountain. Show you some. So this is actually Inipara Serra, who was the founder of all the missions coming down El Camino Real and Highway 101 in California. It's a beautiful statue. Inipara Serra lived from 1713 to 1784. He was the founder of the California Missions. This was donated by the William H. Hannon Foundation. Wow, what an amazing job. And just, I mean, the architecture of this is just absolutely stunning. Here's the old mission bell. So you see 1772 at the top there. So I'll show you guys like the gift shop. I don't know how much of it I'm going to be able to film. So there's the daily tours that are available here. Maybe I'll bring you guys along on one of those tours and see if I could talk to doing like a live tour uh, with the guy. But this is the mission gift shop. Kind of see what they have here. Here's some old Native American artifact, and there's actually some like drawings in here. So here's some, I guess this was an arrowhead necklace and rawhide with raw red dye anklet used for decoration and some ceremonial purposes. This is a rattle. Here's some old like mixing bowls. Yes, medicine bowls to grind corn. Look how amazing these paintings are. Hey, Kim Fitzgerald, rock band, what's up? Here's some more arrowheads. These were a chopping tool used by the Native Americans, most likely the Chumash that were here. And these were large stone balls that were used to anchor weights. 
for their canoes. This is an abalone shell that was collected by the beach and used for waterproofing your canoe. And that was known as trummel in the Chumash language. Here it looks like we have some woven Indian, well, I would say Native American baskets. Hey, Stephanie, how's it going? Yeah, most people didn't get a notification. This is a brush. Do they have any holy metals you can buy? Um, are you talking about like necklaces and stuff? Here's some, actually some British Columbia baskets. So these are different kinds of baskets from all over the world. Here's some furs and arrowheads. These are black obsidian onyx spearheads for hunting. That's pretty cool. Nice. Awesome. Here's some more artifacts here. This is actually part of a sundial that was dated back to 1796, unearthed in 1928. Desks and it's an old cross. And these are what the beds look like. That's pretty uncomfortable looking, huh? So I got one of my lights on just so you can see what these things look like a little better. Uh, holy metals you can buy and keep in your pocket or purse. Oh, I didn't know about that. I'll definitely have to check this out. Guys, I didn't know this museum was so extensive and I've lived here in my whole life. I guess I just never went through the rest of it. So there's like an old violin. Some old music notes. Here's an old guitar. more bowls and tools. Hope you guys are enjoying this. Look at these old shows. It's so cool. Hey, foul fish, how's it going? the old shoes that the Chumash wore. Yeah. 
here we go. This is kind of cool. Look at this, guys. Wow. So, it'd be interesting to see what this was. This is actually a 19th century black wedding dress. What do you guys think about that? According to the family that donated, this elaborate wedding dress was worn by an ancestor about 1830. The, the sequins added a special flair to the garment they had been invented about 75 years prior. Well, that's cool. Hey, Jay Baker, what's going on? Yeah, it's interesting, a black wedding dress. Man, that cross is beautiful right there. Has the old candles. Some old artifacts, old chest. Looks like an old saddle of some kind. That's beautiful. Look at this dress. A cowboy hat. Looks like these were some old coins. There's some old pictures. Yeah, for sure, Ray. We'll definitely come here on Tuesday. Oh, I found the uh, found a doll, guys. You guys know how I feel about dolls. There's some more dolls down here. Nice. Look at this, guys. These are some of the old clothing. Here's a sewing machine from back then. This was a sewing machine from 1856. Hey, Razul, or Razul Roma videos. How's it going, buddy? Good to see you. So I'm kind of just touring this mission here. Look at this. That's so cool. So this is all behind glass, but look how beautiful that is. Wow. Let's see what's this way. I'll keep it pointed down here. Okay, guys, so here's this. Let me know what you guys. 
guys think? So these are some olden style clothes. Like a little fire, coal fireplace. Here is a phonograph. That is very, very cool phonograph. How are you guys enjoying this so far? Here's some Native American artifact. That's Frey Junipero Serra, who founded all the missions. Here's a red dress. Hey, Susie's channel, how's it going? 20 people in the house, awesome guys, thank you. So these are just uh, old wooden door frames that were originally on the mission. You can see the old door frames from the mission. And they were soaked and stretched to spread across the flame or frames. And they were used instead of glass. Here's another window frame. Thank you so much, you guys. These window frames were used in the earliest mission buildings. The Padres used to hide, or used hides that were soaked and stretched to provide them and put them instead of glass. So they used animal hides instead of glass. Interesting. So that's what it would have looked like prior to the red, the resort the rebuilding of this mission. That's what the old doors looked like. So prior to it being completely rebuilt, that's what it looked like. Thank you guys, really appreciate it. gift shop guys check out this other part of the gift shop <laughs> so here's some crosses you can buy Quite a bit more expensive than the other mission, so. so guys that pretty much like is the whole mission i got to walk through with you uh, is there anything else you guys wanted to see while you were with me on camera there's just a lot of people in town for the holidays right now they have santa's workshop Yes, so I will be doing a f photo gallery for Presence of the Unknown. So this is a restricted area. 
So I can't actually climb up on here without getting in too much trouble. But this is another old archway. They're doing a renovation right now. That's the word I was trying to think of earlier. A renovation. And uh, so yeah. I guess I'll show you the old library too. The building's been here forever as well. Oh, hey, Terry Cope, what's going on? Yeah, a lot of people didn't get notifications. YouTube didn't want you guys to see this stuff. But I'm so glad you found your way here. Thank you so much, you guys. If you guys want me to do more of these in the future, let me know. Okay, and that's pretty much the whole length of that building so I'll walk over here there's actually a art museum right there and right here is the old library here in San Luis Obispo and there's old Bessie the Bessie the clown or the Bessie the cow look at that that's cool Oh, awesome. That's good. I'm glad you found it, though, Terracope. So this is a free library. This building is very, very old. I'm trying to remember what year it was when it was built. It was something in the early 1900s, I think. Oh, cool. So, this building was built in 1905, looks like. This was the Carnegie City Library. It's an absolute stunning day here in San Luis Obispo, California. You guys get to see this in 1080p, which is awesome. I don't know how much the art museum is. Uh, show you some of these. Here's a better shot of the mountain. I don't know if I can zoom in here. Not looking like it, but that's actually the Madonna Mountain. So I hope you guys are enjoying that. Look at this amazing palm tree. There's some creepy, there's like a poster up there called Our Stories Matter. It looks really creepy. Kind of walk do a little tour of the town might as well got nothing else to do today thank you for the 20 people watching i do appreciate all of your support you guys this is a cool house three away from 1100 awesome guys razul that's awesome yeah, it's more like a foothill. It's actually an ancient volcano is what it is. They're called the Nine Sisters. There's nine ancient volcanoes all in a line going from here to uh, Morro Bay, California. And the last one being Morro Rock, which is famous here. Look at this old farmhouse up here. No problem, you guys. I'm glad you liked the video. There's some, there's like an older 
No problem, Razul. Look at this. That's a cool fence. Make sure I go over here. Yeah, guys, make sure you hit the bell notifications. Sorry that nobody got updated that this was going live. I thought it would. It just inadvertently didn't. So I don't know why. But I'm glad you guys made it. Hold on, I'm going to plug in my phone here because I did bring the battery pack. I'm sure this hour-long live stream has now... Uh, drain my battery pretty sufficiently. So there we go. There is the Museum of Art. Yeah, no problem. I'm glad I got to show you guys on a tour. We'll do more of these. Uh, most of them are going to be on Presence of the Unknown. But Joe couldn't make it today, so I decided to do it on my channel. But I am going to put a picture gallery up of the San Luis Obispo Mission. So make sure you check that out today. Look how beautiful this is, guys. Wow, this is uh, this is the San Luis Obispo Creek. Sorry, I'll just take you guys on like a little nature detour here. So the creek is finally running because we finally got some rain. So it's beautiful and peaceful. And there's some ducks right there, if you can see those swimming around. There we go, there's the ducks. There you go. Beautiful, beautiful path. So this path actually goes for quite a long time. Ends up on the other side of the town over by the barbecue restaurant. Takes you behind some of these other restaurants here. Oh yeah, you're uh, <laughs> laughing at the ducks. Or my duck whack. I'd love to stay on with you guys forever. I know there is a little bit of a lag. I don't know why. Sorry about it, guys. 17, 16 people watching. So awesome. Uh, oh, kids like mommy. There's duckies. Yeah, it's pretty incredible. These phone cameras are absolutely mind blowing. I'm not even joking. You guys want to see something really so make sure i'm gonna give you guys a little tour of rocket fizz there's some pretty cool stuff in rocket fizz Are you yeah yeah how many, how many subscribers you have uh so getting close to 1700 god who are you uh just a regular guy just like uh i'd run a paranormal live stream paranormal yeah but so i'm kind of ghosts <laughs> all right so uh, Oh yeah. We have them here. Oh yeah, no, for sure. Isn't there an Indian burial ground here in town? Yeah, but they built on it. Oh. Uh, there was. I don't know how they. Weren't got they? Away they with weren't supposed to. Dude, I don't know how they got away with it because it was open for the longest time, and then all of a sudden they built the Alona Club on the top of it. And, and oh, that's where it was. Oh, okay. 
That's it. Awesome. When he got out of college, mm -hmm. he came over. He knocked on my door. I opened the door. He was white as a ghost. That on Broad Street? Yep. Yeah. It's that one. So there was that was all land for ever. Oh my god. Oh yes. Dude. Well, thank you so much. Oh yeah. And then the next day, I kicked the vertebrae out. <laughs> so guys, this is Rocket. Okay, so we have pre. Size. Hey, how's it going? No, just kind of giving my uh, viewers a tour of the whole city and started at the mission and kind of walking around. Got about 20 people live with me right now just watching and had to show them Rocket Fizz. Uh, guys, look at this. Bacon soda. Sweet corn, peanut butter soda, guys. Maybe I'll have to do like a YouTube challenge with the peanut butter soda. Maple syrup, peanut butter and jelly. Mustard, oh my God, guys, look at that. Mustard and ranch dressing soda. Uh, I don't know if I can stomach that, but they have. It's like, uh, oh, they have like duck beer. It looks like the Simpsons beer, but it's an energy drink. Don't forget the plate juice. The what? Oh my God! From Rick and Morty. Uh huh. Or Good. the liquid rage from Macaroni. Oh, that's awesome. We even have butterbeer from Harry Potter. Oh, nice. We have the classic Japanese ramen sodas. Oh, yeah, the guys, the ramen sodas from side. Japan. That's cool. And then we have the juice, which is kind of like boba. Oh. And tapioca. Really? Yep. Guys, check that out. No way mustard and ranch drink, really? Yes, I believe so. Look how cool this is, guys. So yeah, guys, I just kind of wanted to give you a tour of uh, Rocket Fizz here. Rocket Fizz is awesome. Thank you. People are just driving like crazy. Okay. Uh, these are kind of this kind of the area where a lot of our famous restaurants and bars are. Frog and Peach. So I hope you guys enjoyed the tour. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I'm going to sign off right now. Go grab something to eat. And I will see you guys on Presence of the Unknown for the picture gallery. Take care, everybody.